Welcome back to our all new episode of Grimes Find. Today, we're gonna go treasure hunt. Also, stay tuned to the end of this video because many of you may have saw like that documentary I made on making a Mario that was like an hour and 17 minutes. That was wild, y'all. I actually have the Mario. Should I show it to him? Yeah. I've done all the clipping. I probably put about nine hours of polishing into this thing. So stay tuned to the end to see the 10 ounce Super Mario. All right guys, and also, hey, members, Makari is about to get loaded, I swear. The high bid's up. Y'all go check out that high bid. Y'all wanna see some items in the high bid that you can bid only a dollar for? Video Because I might give you an auction preview, y'all, and we have so much Makari about to go up, y'all. Let's see if I just pick one. Scooby Doo. Four bucks. Oh, twenty fourteen. Very organized. See any other games we need? Oh, look at the molding kit. Mm -hmm. It's from 1992. Yeah. You want to get it? Sure. Four bucks for resale. We'll Alright, guys, so we are here to do some unboxing. Hopefully, this stays focused. You keep an eye on it. Okay. Hi, guys. Are we focused? <laughs> no, we're not focused there. Are we focused back here? All right guys, so hey, we're gonna do some unboxing real quick. You already saw some of this while we were in the store, but you might see it again. I don't know what I was saying. You're gonna see it again. Y'all look, Tyco, what year was this? Uh, 1992. Will of Fortune. And it's in really good condition. I think we paid, what did we pay for that? Two bucks? Oh, I don't know. No, we paid $4 for Four. this. Let us know in the comments, guys. Good deal, bad deal. All around, I think we spent probably roughly, how much did we spend out thrifting? 150 maybe? 100 and, really? Maybe $100. We did all those clothes in a video, didn't we? Yeah, we've already done Okay, y'all seen that. All right, so let's just go. Y'all, all right, so here we go. Y'all, this was 55 cents. Cool. Team Von Eric, who remembers the Von Eriks? Let me know in the comments. If you know the Von Erichs, y'all, I actually met one of the Von Erichs when I was a little boy uh, here in Dallas, Texas. So there's that. That's cool. Y'all, that was 50 cents. I got this because I did see that the old, this is a cloth tag uh, dare shirt, drug shirt. It's American themed. Those are pretty hot right now. What else we got? Oh, the, these are my. Oh, this remember? is Gina's part of her new wardrobe. New wardrobe. Yeah, yeah. May we, hey, we'll do a whole video on both of our closets because I know you give a crap. 
We're gonna keep going through this. So we'll do Gina and I's clothes later. Y'all, that was, I don't know. I think I'm gonna sell this because I don't really know that I would wear this. Oh, but it's so fun. I know, but look, Snowtorious. I like Snowtorious. Yeah, but look, it's got the tag on it. Yeah. So I paid a little oh, extra man. for this. It's from Dillard's. Yeah, it was $50. It's a $50 sweatshirt. I paid $6.56 for it. I know I can probably at least get 25 to 30 bucks for this. And it's almost Christmas time. This is a Gina shirt. We'll show you that in our closet video. Be looking for y'all. Y'all don't want to see my closet. It's going to have guns and bullets in it and dirty clothes. <laughs> what else? Oh, that's when you picked up. Oh, okay. Yourself. So, yeah, okay. There. We'll show them that later. Oh. Uh oh. Threw it in the oven. Hi, guys. Okay, so uh, we. This is a good one. Yeah, this is a good one. We paid $1.41. Is that fine? Sweet 16, this is going to go on Macari. So, hey guys, remember if you are a member, you can pick any of these shirts. We put them a little bit high on purpose, guys. We're not trying to really make money on Macari right now. We put them at 20, so nobody will buy them. That so way you the, can the pick them. Can get that. So the members can pick them. But if you don't pick them after a month, we're going to drop them to 10 bucks, sell them. So, hey guys, members, make sure to go to Macari right. Actually, don't go right now. In a couple days. I keep telling them, I don't want to tell them again. Our plan this week is the auction's up and now Macari's about to get loaded. But y'all, I'm telling y'all, we have hundreds of items for y'all. Hey, this place is packed, y'all. Chick was me mugging me. That was she. Yeah. It's she Hi, Mom. All right, guys, so it went pretty well for Gina. How many items did you get? Uh, four. Three or four? All right, she got three or four, and I ended up getting, like, one item. And I plan on loading up Macari, like, big time. I know I keep saying that, but for real, like, I feel like we're going to do this time. Yeah. Y'all, we have so much clothes. This is not a... We probably... We do. My goal is probably by the end of the next week, let's see if we can do it, and y'all hold us accountable. 1,000 pieces up, and that means, members, you know the dang deal, you're going to be able to pick from it. So, hey, we will get those up. Uh, so we'll just keep searching. So, hey, stay tuned to this Tinio. Tinio. Hey, stay tuned to this Tinio, man. I hadn't even been drinking yet. I'm joking. I haven't drank <laughs> in all. almost two years. Yeah. All right. So, hey, there's that. Why is this guy staring at us? He's staring what? at us. Yeah. I feel like he's just trying to act I like he like wasn't he staring at us. Weren't you too? Yeah. Yeah, guys. He did. He saw us look up. Mm -hmm. And then he decided to. To go scratch his mirror. To go mirror scratch a mirror. On the passenger side. Of a car now that's he, not his. That's not even his. He's walking away. That was weird. Y'all, I'm telling y'all, Dallas that's is weird. getting weird. That's weird. So this dude was walking from this, you know, no, you know what? What? He might be trying to steal that car. Oh, you think so? Well, he walked from there. Uh-huh. Over to the I car. I looked up and he saw me. We made eye contact. Then he weirdly changed direction and walked up to this car in front of us and scratched the passenger window or mirror. And then walked off. And then walked off to the, the next opposite store. direction. Yeah. Interesting. All right, guys. Next, off to the next stop. All right, guys. So hey, I just remembered this one. I haven't been to this one in probably over a year and a half. No, three years. This one used to have a ton of smalls and a ton of vintage. Oh, this is plush. a good one. This is a concert tee. It's bigger. Mary J. Blige. It's a good one. Yeah, that's a good yeah. one, y'all. She. I mean, back in the '90s, I used to jam some Mary J. Uh oh. Y'all, this was four bucks. It's from Spencer's. Y'all remember Spencer's? Oh, I remember Spencer's. Yeah, boy, Spencer's ain't around no more. But Johnny Cash, giving the dirty bird. <laughs> Y'all, I bought this in the kids section for 99 cents. It's vintage, I think. A little bit vintage. But look, it's Ninja Turtles. It's the, definitely the, the vintage 80s, uh, 88 Ninja Turtle uh, figures. But it's got the American flag theme, and that's pretty cool. What else? Hey guys, you can grab one too and tell them all about it. Okay. Yeah, I bought this one for two bucks. Uh, but look, it's Star Trek. It is a size large, but look, it's got the cloth Star Trek tag. Uh, so two bucks, I bought that Star Trek stuff sells hot. Yeah. 
Redskins. Oh yeah, okay, so this is a big size, guys. This is for a big boy, and I'll be honest, I think this shirt is new and has not been worn. You can just tell like when it hasn't been washed. Yeah. Uh, but I paid four bucks for this, and the reason I did that is because the Washington Redskins are no more. So they're not going to be making any more of their product because evidently it's racist. Even though the Indians don't have a problem with it. Right. Yeah, I think you it's always the white people got a problem with everybody else's problems. <laughs> I think you bought this one. Yeah, I did, but we'll show you that later. Um, oh yeah. I don't even know what that is. I don't know what that oh is. yeah, dude, it's a concert T-shirt. Oh, who is it? Yeah, three bucks. It's the Eagles. Oh, the Eagles. Oh, it's a 50th anniversary, y'all. Uh, 2021. It hasn't even happened yet. Y'all, how did we get an exclusive 2021 50 year anniversary? Huh? I don't know. I don't know. I think the rest of this stuff is mine. Alright, so this is Gina. Yeah, y'all, Gina like overloaded I it. I did. I got more Let's than just make I should. Sure. Let's make sure. Oh no. Is that yours? Oh, I threw it in the sink again. Oh, okay, I got I this one. one. This is a good deal, y'all. I only paid $349 for this, but you can tell it's new too. It has not been washed. Uh, it's a 2012. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah, it's a it's a Harley Davidson of Dallas. Allen 22. These are collectible. People collect these from all different states and stuff. This one does feel new and does not appear to be washed. It is a men's medium. Okay. Cool. The last thing is that your cups. What about this? Is that yours? Yeah, this is all mine. All right, this is all Gina stuff. So while Gina was shopping, y'all, I went through literally thousands of shirts. And you I can go. I, them. Yeah, <laughs> I can go through a whole it. rack of shirts in about ten minutes. I just like a crackhead. Y'all know me. But y'all, look, I found these. Uh, I'm trying to read. It says EPE Reg US Patent. Y'all, look, these are Elvis Presley glasses. Hold on. Hi guys, can you see Elvis? Y'all, but look, I got these for a dollar forty-one a piece. So they're like beer pilsners, but they got the king on them. So those will be in the auction, guys. Hey, make sure to go check out the high bid auction right now. It starts. Everything starts at all. I got no reserves, y'all. Even on the pew pews, uh, the expensive art, y'all. There's expensive items hidden all through the freaking uh, auction. Don't sleep on I'm telling you, resellers, there's a lot of stuff to be uh, have money. Dang, I just pulled a Biden. <laughs> About to pull another Biden. Where am I? <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, no, I'm joking. But poor old guy. Look, poor you guy. can hang up, the, hang up the freaking gloves, bro. All right, guys. So, hey, y'all, we just found some cool stuff at this last store that we went to. And check it out. Y'all, Mario's under there. So check this out, I probably have about nine hours in of just chiseling on the detail. Like my hands hurt so bad. But I probably got another 15 to 20 hours to put in. But it's under here, I'm gonna show you how far it's come along. And I'm serious guys, let's do a push. Actually go check out the comment on the, what is it called, community board, check that out. If we get to whatever the numbers are, I'm gonna give it away. So check it out. We gotta find, or we found some cool stuff. Mm -hmm. All right, some of this stuff I'm actually, I found my one shirt I am absolutely keeping today. Uh, and I actually really, really like it and it's something I'll wear. So check this out, it's not this one. This is like a vintage Guggen Squad. <laughs> vintage Guggen Squad. It is vintage Guggen Squad. I bet that ain't new. So uh, <laughs> y'all, hey, all you Guggen freaks, let me know if this is vintage. I think that's vintage Guggen. That's, hey man, that's good stuff. This one I'm keeping for myself. Um, how much yeah. did I spend on this? Two dollars. Two bucks. Oh yeah, everything was two bucks in this store. Mm -hmm. So that's a large, it's a Legend of Zelda. I like it. Uh, two bucks, y'all, yeah boy. Now I gotta lose some weight before I wear this one. But Cody Simpson, y'all, Gina I does- I still don't know who he is. Yeah, y'all think? That looked good on me. Gina says she doesn't remember Cody Simpson. Y'all let me know down in the comments who remembers Cody Simpson. All right, y'all, two bucks, Keith Urban uh, for 2007. So not a bad shirt, that will be in Macari. All right, guys, I'm actually gonna keep this one just because it's Charlie Brown, it's my size, it was two bucks. And like I said, I'm trying to rebuild the wardrobe now that I'm not like in depression. 
You ready? Oh. All right. Frick ass, we're really ready this time. Uh, I just said that because I don't want to go find that clip and delete it. There it is. Uh, so, hey, y'all, look, because I'm about to get my sexy on. Eisenberg. Y'all, Eisenberg. But it's a, it's a little bit tiny. It's tiny, y'all, but look. It's a beside the pool shirt. I woke up at 4.30. I had coffee, y'all, and I just got down on the floor. You don't know this. I started doing push-ups. I was like, can I still do push-ups? I was like, uh-uh. I knocked out 50 in a row, and I was like, uh -huh. I didn't. I was like, I didn't even think I was going to be able to do 10 with my old butt. But check it out, y'all. I'm trying to get my sexy back, and that shirt's going on this. All right, look. This is kind of cool. Y'all, this was two bucks. But look, Bob Tom's Ford... It's a mechanic jacket, but it's clean. It doesn't have like oil stains that I can see all over it. But like that's, it. I mean, this is in style. Yeah. Uh, so hey, two bucks. All right, this one's going on Macari. Um, Y'all, I'm trying to find bigger size shirts. I know we're getting a lot of requests. I'm trying to find them. I promise you we have over 500 shirts now that we are going so up. many that we need Tomorrow, to Tomorrow, we are focused on Macari, promise. Oh, y'all, and I'm bidding on some units. All right, y'all, I got this for myself. I'm joking. <laughs> hey, that's mine. Gina liked this. This is yeah, cute. Yeah, it's cute. Yeah, this it's is totally sweatshirt. my wife. We're back. Is this yours too? That's mine too. Y'all, I would kind of sport that. Oh, oh, is that V-neck? It's a men's shirt. Oh, I can I have this please? Hey, we can share it. Okay, we're gonna share this, y'all. I love this shirt. I'm wearing this in the next video, maybe. All right, y'all, I got this for myself too, but it was two bucks. I'm a cheapskate. But look, round bodies. It's a Homer Simpson. It says Springfield Gym. I thought that was cool. Y'all, the reason real quick why I'm rebuilding my wardrobe is for real. I've been in like depression and anxiety horribly just being a business owner and stuff like that. And I'm actually coming out of it. So I'm kind of getting rid of bad memories if any of y'all know what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. So I'm cleaning out my closet like Eminem. Uh, I'm joking. Kept this one. Are you recording? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, why do you do that? Could you do that? You be psyching me out. Stop doing that. <laughs> um, Y'all, look at that. I'm keeping this one for myself ah. because it's a large. It looks like older school, so I like that one. That's going in my new wardrobe. Um, oh. Ah, yeah. Y'all, I'm so disappointed that I'm trying to get smaller and not bigger. I almost thought about putting on weight just so I could fit this shirt. Play Aiken, y'all. Look. Look at that. How many pleats? Can you believe that that many people wanted Clay Aiken to come there? Like, there was a high enough demand for that. Look at that. All right, guys. I bought these for $2.99 uh, because these are 2009. They got a cloth tag, but they're in good. But it's John Cena uh, short. So those will be on Macari, too. All right, y'all. This is my shirt. This is my favorite shirt that I found in a long time. Look at this, y'all. This is cool. And it's long sleeve. For real. That's Paul Walker, y'all. Look. So it's a large, but it says Buster. Uh, so anyway, look. Boy, I love this shirt. Y'all let me know. Do y'all like this shirt? I like Paul Walker. He seemed like he was probably, I, don't, I mean, I don't know him personally. He did jiu-jitsu. I did jiu-jitsu. Uh, he's an awesome actor. I'm an awesome actor. Actually, our awesome, if we're being honest, our acting skills were probably the same. I did not like him because of his acting skills. I thought he was probably a stand-up dude. Alright guys, in the moment you've all been waiting for, y'all, y'all want to see how far I've come along. So I'm not anywhere near it. Alright, you're going to have to focus in on this. Here, let's come over here on the white cabinets. Yeah. Alright, here it is. So look guys, I trimmed all of the extra off so far. I still have more to do. A lot more to do. Man, I got these rounded chisel, and I'm actually able to go in here and start putting detail in on it. See, look, this was real bad where the seam was, but look, I actually, that's where the seam was, and I worked all of that out, and then I'm, just, I'm gonna round this all back off. Uh, I still gotta get in here. Uh, look, I got the detail so good you can see between his legs, y'all. Y'all can see up in freaking Mario's little squibble area. Look at this, y'all. So look, I gotta polish the face. I'm painting the face. I am gonna paint the face. Here's what's gonna happen. He's, the jumpsuit or his overalls are staying silver. The hat's staying silver besides the black band. I'm painting the face because I want the detail of the eyes and the hair. Look at the detail on the hair, y'all. 
uh, and we're going to paint the shoes and his gloves and then we're going to keep the top of the tortoise shell and this part silver but we're going to do the the tr like the color of the actual uh koopa shell or whatever it's called and then look down here and i'm going to make it look like it's in a battle like with the koopa car and i'm going to put this in a freaking shadow box with the other thing but y'all look at that so y'all let me know rate me right now be kind but uh look at that what do y'all think this is the only second time i've done this y'all look at that so i'm still got a lot to do but look at i did you know i've still got to buff it i went to walmart and i bought a dremel so now i'm gonna be able to get in all these cracks but y'all i'm like i'm obsessed ain't i yeah you are. i carried this around in the car with me today like an old man i'm like hur, hur. you know what i mean now all <laughs> yeah. i need is my glasses and be like y'all i think i just realized that i'm old <laughs> 